Welcome to the best wall mount easel assembly and installation instructional video. These are the tools we recommend having handy before you begin the installation process. Your easel will be shipped in two boxes. Both boxes will have a corresponding number circled. Open your box to find the printed instructions. The instructions will be located in the larger of the two boxes. Remove the instructions and read them thoroughly before beginning your installation process. Remove all easel components from the box. Referencing your instructions, ensure that no parts are missing. These are the components found in the hardware bag. The first step in mounting your easel is determining the mounting height. This will be your preference, and we do recommend two people for this step to assist with stabilizing the easel while deciding on placement. For this video, we are mounting our easel two feet off the ground. Have two people hold the easel in place while another marks the wall through the pre-drilled screw holes. These holes are located 16 inches apart and should land on the studs that you pre-marked before getting started. Before mounting the easel, remove the masts and the easel H frame. This will reduce the weight while mounting the frame to the wall. To remove the H frame, take out the connector bolts at the top of the frame. Remove both sets of bolts along with the tilt adjustment bar. Have someone stabilize the frame while removing the hinges located at the base of the frame. Only remove one side of each hinge. The side you should remove is the one connected to the wall mounting frame. Now that the easel frame has been stripped down, you are ready to mount it to the wall. The pre-drilled screw holes are located 16 inches apart and should fall right on the studs you pre-measured before getting started. Have two people hold the easel in place while a third positions and screws in the easel. Before screwing in the easel, use a level to ensure the position is correct. Reattach the H frame to the wall mounted frame. Have one person stabilize the H frame while the other puts the screws back in place.
While the H frame is tilted forward, replace both masts by sliding them back into the channels. Replace the tilt adjustment bar using the connector bolts. It is now time to attach the bottom canvas holder. Before attaching the canvas holder, make sure the elevator bolts are in the loosest position. holder over the mass channels. Secure the bottom canvas holder in place by tightening the elevator bolt. Find both ends of the rope located by the pulley on the back side of the bottom canvas holder. Untie both of the knots and thread the end of the rope through the eye screw at the top of the H frame. Tie a knot to secure the rope in place. Loosen the elevator bolts on the front of the bottom canvas holder and lower the bottom canvas holder. Look at the back side of the bottom canvas holder to make sure that the rope is threaded properly through the pulley channels. You can now attach your winch handle Using a wrench, place the handle in place and tighten the bolt. You can now freely move the bottom canvas holder using the winch. When using the winch, ensure that your elevator bolts are completely loosened. There is a lever located next to the handle. When in the down position, you are able to raise the bottom canvas holder. When in the up position, you are able to lower the canvas holder. It is time to add your top canvas holders. There are two for this easel. Before putting them into position, make sure that you've completely loosened the elevator bolts and slide them over the top of the mast. Your easel installation is now complete and the easel is ready to use. Happy painting! Thank you.